The Phantom of the Opera, which is the longest running show in Broadway history. Now fans can check out the sequel called Love Never Dies, which is currently playing in Chicago. We're so lucky, and we have two of the stars here with us this morning. They're both from Chicago, Megan and 13-year-old Casey. Welcome, guys. Hey, how are you? <laughs> I love Phantom of the Opera. It's one of my favorite shows. So where does Love Never Die pick up? Oh, it's 10 years later, and actually you find all your characters in America, in Coney Island, although we've been living in France. Um, I, I play Christine Daae, and... And play Casey, stuff? My son. Wonderful. <laughs> and um, so, yeah, we find them actually Coney Island. Phantom has escaped from Paris, and he's running his all his tricks and games, if you will, out there. And then we have to come. I'm an opera singer, and they lured me there, and... Okay. <laughs> so have you guys been eating French food just to prepare? Oh, I wish. <laughs> I, would, I would be a small ball if that happened. French bread. <laughs> yeah. French bread. Butter. Right, you know. exactly. Of course yeah. the fries part. That's good. <laughs> yeah. So the show premiered in London in 2010, correct? Yes. And so this is the first time it's in America and it's in Chicago. True. And also it's a completely rewritten show. It's not actually the show that uh, you would have wow. seen if you would have seen it in London. It was rewritten and redone in Australia and then Germany. And so now in this incarnation, um, not only is uh, our, our U.S. audience is seeing the show for the first time ever, but they're seeing this show in this particular form for the first time ever. It's really exciting. So, so this show, speaking of, this is your city. You guys are both from yes, Chicago. Yes, yes, yes. What is it like to perform a show in the town you grew up in? It's crazy. It's been a real dream come true. Mm -hmm. Really? What do you feel when you get on that stage and see the audience? Uh, it's just incredible. It's a it, really yeah. awesome ride. It's, it's awesome. It, like, literally, I mean, and Chicago audiences are so, I mean, you know, it's like, they're the best. It, mm -hmm. I mean, it's literally like going to a Cubs game, you know, yeah. because everyone's just like, we know you. And so there's so many people <laughs> every peanuts. single night. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. Less peanuts. Less but, peanuts. But, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. But it's incredible to have the, the energy and the love in the audience. So That's awesome. Mm -hmm. And you've been in a ton of different productions around Chicago. How'd you get started in theater? Um, randomly, you know, I did a, a musical a year in high school and but really I'm actually from the opera world to be honest with you and I've crossed over only into Broadway music theater very recently and I love it um, so yeah amazing have you both met Andrew Lloyd Webber by any chance mm -hmm. yeah of you course have. oh yes of course yes tell me about that do you want to go sure that's incredible. It was it was really cool. I was like my little musical theater nerd instincts were like <laughs> ah! because I uh, <laughs> I went up to him. He was he was in the wings, and the first time I met him, he was backstage, and I he was kind of going in for a handshake, but I wasn't really sure how to go, so I kind of like hugged. I don't know. <laughs> You're but I, I hugged of him. Course you yeah, hug. of course yeah, I hugged. We, do. we hug. We hug. Yeah. See, <laughs> so you guys. I always wonder when I go see shows if um, the actors can see the audience. Can you see people when oh, you're yeah. performing? Oh mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, you def you can definitely see them. Yeah. Although I have I have really bad eyes, so like when <laughs> when I see lights, there's a big like glare, but. If you're in the few front rows, yes. you try not to look though, because if you find someone you actually know, you're like, oh no, and you're like, oh hey, how are you? But yeah. <laughs> and so, do you feel? Do you get nervous when you see them? You have to like make sure that no, no. you don't care. You've been, you're a pro. <laughs> I don't know. I love being. Hey, the more the merrier outside. I mean. Oh, there's 3,000, 5,000? Sure, bring them all in. I know, I love being on stage. <laughs> and so. then before we leave you, favorite snack that you get at the theater? This is the most important question oh of the day. Oh my goodness. This one's so hard. <laughs> I love that you're like, have you met Andrew? Yes, we love him. <laughs> yeah, <I know. laughs> um, um, you first, because I got to think. Uh, I have to think, too. Don't say water. It oh, has to no. be like M&M, no. M &M, M &M, Skittles. No, there's always so talking? many treats happening back there. Are. They, you know, there's lots of sugar that they give us. Lots of cakes, <laughs> right? Cake? Oh, lots yeah, of cakes. Oh, yeah. that's nice. Yeah, I'm going to say Toblerone. That's okay. good. All right, thank you guys thank you. so much. <laughs> Love Never Dies is playing at the Cadillac Palace Theater through March 4th. Broadwayinchicago.com is where you can find all ticket information.